Hello, welcome to 40 Tic Tac Toe, this series in which you're mashing up two different things and find a play that has that in common. And today, we're joined by Cat. We're going up, Tom. How are you doing, mate? I'm ready, mate. I'm come with my ridiculous requirements, green kits, etc., etc., to try and bamboozle you and beat you at your own game. Yeah, we'll see about that. What would you like to start with on the grid? You know what? Just before we get into this, I've, I, I was thinking, how do I beat Luke Pingu? What I was thinking is you could literally choose like three different teams. They're, they're like really random, but you know, they, they've had some decent some players at them and then you just learn like a player that's played at that club that's played for like every other big team that you can imagine and then mm. every time you do it you'd always win go on then my brain is so massive but i haven't had the time unfortunately <laughs> yeah. i haven't had the time to sit down and do this ridiculous task but i think people would hate it because you come on every time and i'd be like okay we're going to use aek athens today again for like the seventh episode in a row mm. you just stop inviting me so i do that you like to win so i'll let you win but by that i mean beat you but i'm gonna go real madrid real Madrid to kick yes. things off. Yes. Let's go. What I've just said is what Luke has actually done because he's about to do something. Watch it, watch it. What's he going to put? Mm, fancy a bit of Bundesliga, Tom. Oh, Sorry okay. Buy a Leverkusen. That's doable. Is it? <laughs> yeah. I'll go lost a World Cup final. They can also have won it, but they had to have lost it on a an occasion. Let's go. I might go for a nation, but then I've got to pick a nation that's lost a World Cup final. But maybe I could choose. Like, here's the thing, Tom. I could choose something back in the day. Go ahead. You know? Do whatever you want, mm -hmm. mate. So like West West Germany. <laughs> West before 90... Germany. No, 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 no. I won't do that. Not even a country anymore, mate. If I can't no. have Mbula for French when he's changed <laughs> nations, you can't have a country that don't exist. Come on now. You know the rules. We will go for a bit of Aston Villa then. Oh, good. Uh, let's go a nation and we will go just because it's starting to look just a little bit tricky, France. And I'll end off with... Do you know what, Tom? We'll go for anyone who's played in the Turkish league. Oh, Turkey. Yeah. Lost a World Cup final and Aston Villa. Bloody hell. Mm. That is quite challenging, mate. I can't even remember who lost them. Like, I don't know why I put that on the board when I can't even remember who's lost them. Mm-hmm. Let's go France, Aston Villa. Digne. Digne Woodwork. I actually yes. had like a full panic moment there that Digne didn't even play for Villa. Like I'm literally, mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit sketchy today, I won't lie. That's what we love to see. I will go for Bayer Leverkusen Real Madrid. There's a couple for this that I know. But we'll go for Danny Carvajal. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. Let's go Turkish League, Real Madrid, and we'll go Mesut Ozil. All right, I will go, kind of need the middle at this point, unless we go for the opposite corner. Yeah, let's go opposite corner first because you might struggle with the middle we'll get Turkish League French and we will say it's a bit of a gamble but I'm going to say like Remy pretty well, do you sure think he played for like Trabonzaspor or something like that something in you know this is where it turns out he's actually changed nation <laughs> That'd be brilliant. Like Remy has played for two teams in Turkey. It's greedy. Rizzo Spore and Adanya Dama Spore. No, not the one that I said then. Nope. So do you know the middle, Tom? Right, so I need a Villa player that's lost the World Cup final. Mmm, tricky. Problem is, I can only think of the last two. Who were? France and then Croatia. Mm -hmm. Good job Digne wasn't in the squad, otherwise I'd be screaming right now. Mmm, before that it was Argentina. Was it? And, and then before that it was... Netherlands. I'll give you them too, Tom. See if you can get it. Mm. Argentina and then the Netherlands. I'm trying to think through the Croatia team at the moment. Mm. Let's see if there's anyone that I think that might have played for them. I don't think like anyone like Chorluka or Subasic or any of them gents have ever played for Aston Villa. France, I don't think, like the French team is just so stacked. I don't think Aston Villa has any of them, especially this recent. Argentina from 12 years ago. 10 years ago. Only 10. That was still a long time ago. Why do I have like a weird feeling like Simeone or something like played for Aston Villa. I just have this weird feeling, but I don't even know if he'd be in the squad 10 years ago. Still think that's too recent. I feel like Van Bommel might have been a player that played for Aston Villa as well. I'm really clutching, to be honest. This is, I, I should never have put lost the World Cup final when I don't even know who anyone past the last two were. That was a yeah. silly move by me. Um, mm -hmm. Like the goalkeeper, what was his name? Stecklenberg. He's been around forever. He might have lost the World Cup final back then. I really haven't got a clue. There's a few names that I've got, like, m my shortlist would be like Van Bommel. Uh, I'll say Stecklenberg. He did lose that final, Tom. Yeah, he never played for Villa, though, did he? In 2010. He, he never played for Aston Villa. Everton, Fulham, and Oh, it was Everton that I was thinking of. Oh, he did mm. play. Yeah, that's not the, that's not the worst shout. Not the worst shout. No. Go on, then. Finish, finish me off, mate. I don't even know if he played that final, but I'm going to try Ron Vlaar for Aston Villa. Mm. The old that's, Dutch centre yeah. Definitely played 2014 World Cup. It's whether he played 2010. Oh, no. Don't, put, don't say that you haven't got it and that I've got to go through all that again. Yeah. 
Christ on a bike. I don't think he has it. He's got the third place in 2014, but doesn't have oh, a runner no. up. Has he not called Luke. up for that year? He must have not been caught. He must have been injured or something. Oh, Luke. Yeah, he was included in the preliminary squad. However, he suffered a leg injury while Luke. training. Luke, what have you done to us? The problem is I can't win any way other than getting the middle square. Mm. Flipping it. I could just call it. Maybe it's not possible. Yeah, it will be. There'll be some Frenchmen. I'll say, um, I don't know if he was in the squad, but he might have been. Mm. Yeah, Diaby. Then I don't think he was called up though for the 20. Yeah, no, I think he was. He had that really good season at um, was it Leverkusen last year, didn't he? Mm. I will put him on the grid though, Tom, in France by Leverkusen. That is that is snaky, mate. You are a snake. Now I've got two ways of winning. You are a snake. Lost World Cup final. France player from Bayer Leverkusen. And I think who might have been in that team? I don't think Bayer Leverkusen really have a good French contingent, do they? Um, mm -hmm. Croatians. I'm like Leverkusen is the kind of places that. The kind of place that Chorluka played. But he might be too old. He might not have even been there. But that was six years ago. Mm. Yeah, I'll go Chorluka. See if he was in there. Chorluka. I don't think he would have been playing for. Uh, I don't even know if he played. Or... I don't. I don't even know if he played for Bayer Leverkusen, mate. I'm just. He did seven games, Tom. There you go. Look at me. Knowledge. However, did he play that final? I don't think so. He probably won't have done. He'll be too old, won't he? Yeah, she did, Tom. 2018. Oh, look at me! Veteran call Luca. Come on, baby. Now you can't win by going through the middle no more. Oh, you can win by going through the middle. What am I yeah, talking yeah. about? You're, you mean this. <laughs> you. Yeah, Pay no, I'm, I'm really good at this. I'm really good at this game. I don't know if Robert Perez would have still been playing for France in 2000. Sure, that yeah. Mm, so when he got called up, though. Robert Perez had played in 2006 because he did play for Aston Villa. I'm going to try Robert Perez because that seems... Cause surely he would have played for Arsenal in that Champions League final. Let's see if he works for that. I swear if he retired from like French Street. Oh, he retired from French Street in 2004. What a weirdo. He went on to play for another like decade as well. What was the one before that? Was it Germany that lost before Netherlands? Um, 2006 was France and then 2002 was Germany again. I, I wonder if there's just like a German player that came through Villa, like that played maybe like a couple of games there at the end of their career. My brain is saying like Jens Lehmann. I don't know if he ever. I, I have. He's like one of those per people that like played for Arsenal, came back for like four games in the Prem. But who it was for? I don't know. Yeah, I'll, I'll say Jens Lehmann then as my as the middle guess. You want Jens? I don't think he ever played for Villa. No. Do you have another Prem team other than Arsenal? No, he came back to play for Arsenal. Oh, That's, fair enough. Did, yeah. yeah. Oh. It's going to be an absolute punt. This is France against Croatia. Actually, yeah. Ooh, oh, would, they, would he be in a third choice goalie? Lovra Kalinic. <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, Lovra, Lovra Kalinic. Was he there? I'll give it to you. We've got it. That is absolutely outrageously good. The only reason I remember is because he played against Derby. Oh, right. In the championship. Okay. Yeah, it does work. There we go. It wow. You know what? Give it, you got to give him a hand there. That is some yeah. elite ball knowledge. I mean, you got to Luca, even though he didn't know he played for Leverkusen. And, uh, well, know. I kind of had an inkling he did, and he's Croatians. Mm. Then he just yeah. about squeezed in there. So yeah, there you go. Just about. Lovre yeah, Kalinic. Must... That's outrageous. Never even heard of the boy. Yeah, for the rest of the board, Real Madrid, Aston. Villa would have been... I don't know if Woodgate ever played for Villa. Good old Jonathan. And then Turkish League lost the World Cup final. Have you got anyone for that, Tom? I don't know. Not off the top of my head. There is actually no players for Aston Villa. And Real Madrid. Real Madrid. Wow, Madrid. look at that. And then Turkish League lost in the World Cup final. Oh, Wesley Schneider. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, good, good. There we go. First round to me, 1-0. Let's go into the next one. Very nice. Right, into round number two. I get to start this time. Uh, we will say Newcastle. Newcastle. So let's go Ajax. Let's go a Champions League winner. Let's go... I use in a vertical stripe kit. <laughs> Good one for Newcastle. Really difficult. I say for that one, Tom, we shouldn't do anyone. You know, you have to have another call. No, yeah, not from Newcastle. Fair play. Yeah. Let's go do one for to play in the uh, Portuguese league, the Liga Nos. Liga Nos, yeah, gotcha. Let's have a nation. Let's go. You know what? Let's go Senegal. Senegalese. Let me get start. And we will go. Let's kick it off with Ajax Newcastle. Clive up. Oh, nice. Patrick. Let's go champs winner. Virtual striped kit. We'll go with Cristiano. Sui. Ronaldo. And did he have a vertical strike kit? Yeah, when he was at uh, Juve. Good one. Oh, what do you know? A Senegalese player in the Liga Nost, Tom? I might be testing you. you know what, I'll see if you if you can. I've got a name, but it's whether you can come up with something. So I'm going to go Newcastle vertical striped kit. Um, Jack Colback. 
Play for okay. Sunderland. Senegalese, Newcastle, we'll go Cissé. Bapis. That's the one. I don't think he's Senegalese, Tom. Can I change my mind then? I'll go Demba Bar. You sure about that? Is he not? He's not going to be Senegalese, is he? I'm going to go Cissé, mate. I'm pretty sure he's Senegalese. You sure? Not sure, no. But I'm going to say him. Yeah, they're both Senegalese. <laughs> you are actually rotten to the core. Disgusting pig. Sorry, that was really rude. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just see if you were sure, Tom. I, I wasn't to... sure, obviously. I'm never sure about anything. Uh, we'll go David Neres. Ajax Liganos. Played for Benfica, of course. Champs, winner, and Ajax. I don't think there's anyone recent I can use here. Because mm. obviously they're like prodigal sons of like Van der Beek. Man United have just demolished him. Frankie de Jong, he ain't won it. Don't think that the Lit has won it. I'm sure there's someone though. I'll go um, De Boer. Frank De Boer. Frank De Boer. He's got to have won it. I'm not 100% sure, but he's, pro he's almost certainly won it. Yeah, Frank over Ronald. Huh? Frank or Ronald De Boer. The manager, the, the one that was an icon, Frank. And he won the Champions League in 1995 with Ajax. Hold on, Tom. He actually won it with the team as well. Well, look at me. Full yeah, knowledge. Yeah. Could have just said Cruyff or, you know, Hollett. Yeah, I was thinking Cruyff or Hollett, but they're so far back, I don't know. The bow is far back anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, Senegalese Champions League winner, Sadio Mane, greatest mm -hmm. player in the world. Just to finish off the game, vertical striped kit and Liga Nos. I'm going to say Pepe, mm. the uh, centre-back plays for Pe Porto and he, they've got a striped kit. Do they? Yeah, blue, white stripes, mate. I guess, yeah. There's not many. There's only like a couple. Senegalese <laughs> in the Liga like, Nos. Everyone likes a board draw, mate. Yeah. I'm going to try Diop because that's a very common Senegalese name. <laughs> You don't need to specify which Diop or what. No, it's just there. any, any, any Diop any in old, the league. Any old, else. yeah, there you go. Oh, there's a, that's annoying. There's a basketball player called Diop. Is he Senegalese? Yeah, <laughs> but no, I can't find anything. But yeah, let us know in the comments if you do know a Senegalese Liga Nos player. But let's go into the next round. Into round number three. Yeah. What would you like to start with, Tom? Chelsea. Chelsea. Chelsea, Chelsea. Did well against Wolves at the weekend. Let's go for a bit of Argentina. Let's go a bit of, I don't know if you'll allow this, an icon or a legend that has been on FIFA. No. Why not? You know them all anyway. I can't be bothered to think of them. Say someone who's won a World Cup or something. <laughs> say somebody who's seen. Let's go with one of Premier League. Prim title. I try to be original and Luke just bats me down. Let me say, anyone to play in the EFL, Tom? Championship League One, League Two. Okay. I'm going to get an interesting category in here at some point, mate. I'm going to mm -hmm. say someone who's made the FIFA Pro, so it has to be FIFA Pro, World Eleven, And has played in the championship at some point. Yeah, I'm sure there's one of them. There must be one. Who? I don't know. I haven't got it on the top of my head, mate. Yeah, but it needs to be doable. I know one, so there you go. Okay. It's fine. Okay. I will end off with then a little bit of Aroma. Aroma, huh? Where do I want to start? EFL, Prem title. There must be so many. Mm. I really want that middle square, though, because you've had it every time. This is really hard. Not really. Uh, I'll go Roma, Chelsea, and I'll go Rudiger. Let's go Argentina, Fifth Pro World, 11, <sighs> Lidl. Messi. Oh, that's a good one, that is. Outside the box. Yeah, let's go EFL, FIFA Pro World 11, Wayne Rooney. You reckon Rooney was in it at some point? Yeah, he was because he was in Team of the Year in FIFA 12 and that was decided by FIFA Pro. Yeah, 2011, wasn't it? Fair enough. Why are you so pissed off about that? I don't know. <laughs> He's <laughs> playing for Derby, mate. Yeah. Let's yeah, go Argentina, Chelsea, Hun and Crespo. Yeah, nice. Argentinian that won the Prem, I'll go Sergio Aguero. Got a more interesting one, Tom? No. Nope. Maybe Probably Willy. Zabaleta or something like that, maybe. Yeah. Willy Caballero, maybe. Or Otamendi. Actually, I'm going to go for the medal because that kind of locks you off in a way. EFL Prem title, Ashley Cole. Best life back in the world. Yeah, that's really annoying because I was actually just about to put him in the FIFA Pro. Board 11. That is true, actually. Yeah. Probably would have worked for left back at Roma. When it would have started the World 11 thing? It's probably quite old. I think I've got a cheeky shout for this. I've got one shout that I think is probably more likely than any others, but mm. still not super, super happy with it. I'm going to say Alison. Some Becker. I would think he's got to be in it. Is in there twice. Yep, that does work, Tom. Yeah, the ones I was, I was actually going to say, I completely forgot about Alison, to be honest. Yeah, so, really that, so did I. I was literally trying to work my way through it for ages. But I was going to say Cafu, a really old one. That's a good one, yeah. Surely two-time World Cup winner. My stab was going to be Daniele De Rossi, but I don't think he would have done Rossi. anything. It's like the only Italian I can think of that played there that was like really, really good. Yeah. Roma and Prem title, I could still win it. I just need Luke to bottle. It's not going to happen. Roma Prem title, we will say. 
say. Is there anything more interesting? I don't think there is, is there, Tom? We're just going to have to say Mo Salah. <sighs> Boring. I well, know. What a shame. And then okay. EFL Chelsea. You don't want to finish it off, Tom? No, not really. You came on loan to Derby. Mason Mount. There you go. Well done, Tom. <laughs> Still 1 0 to me. But yeah, let's see how we do in the next few rounds. Round number four, then. I'm going to get to start again. And we will say. We'll say PSG. I'm going to go Spanish. We'll go for a Prem team. What Prem team have we not said so far? we we'll go Southampton. Not even a Prem team. <laughs> <laughs> let's go Spurs. Cool. That's very nice for my final one, which I want is the Belgian Pro League. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll finish it off with... Have we had the MLS today? Want the MLS? I'll have the MLS, yeah. MLS. Okie dokie. Here we go. I get to start. We will go... I think I might go for the middle. And I might be cheeky, you know, Tom. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to be cheeky. I'm going to go for the middle. And I'm going to say Toby Alderfield. Oh, why would you do that? Just to be funny. Mm, yeah, funny guy. I'll go... Same PSG, why not? Burnout. One Burnout. Yeah. Where's he at now? God knows, mate. He just kept on getting bounced between PSG and Bayern, didn't he? Is it Benfica? Grimaldo's replacement, seems. A downgrade. Mm. Let's go MLS PSG. I want to see how you do with the Belgian Pro League, Spain, Tom. And we will say Lidl Messi. <laughs> Odd. Pro League Spain. I'll give you a clue, Tom. I did this recently in a video, and there's actually bigger players than you think that have played in the Belgian Pro League. You definitely know the players, and you've mm. probably seen their cards on FIFA with a team in the Belgian League. I think he's a World Cup and Euros winner. Yeah, see, I think I've got Cassius written down on my board. I'm not sure, though. Uh, I'll take Cassius. Go on. Don't think Casillas right. is not right, Tom. You've got the right no. position, though. Better not be Valdez, because he's written down on my board as well. It is Victor Valdez, Tom. Oh, no, shut up. Oh, my God. He's literally right there. Yeah. You went on loan from Man United to Standard Liège and then went to Middlesbrough at the end. With, like, it's a great career for Victor Valdez. And the other one is Captain Villa, played in the Belgian mm. League. Yeah, I recently learned that from the comments, so shout out to you lot. Look at you guys, you've made him win again. Just to finish off the board, PSG Spurs could have said La Celso. Spanish at Southampton. Oh, Oriol Romeu, obviously. Oh, yeah, that's And then that Spurs, Belgian Pro League. You got any shouts on that, Tom? I don't know if he actually Tom played. Him? Yeah, I don't know if he know. did ever play in there. Oh, he's there right now yeah he's at Andalou right now yeah yeah that's right other one is uh, Parasic played there that's Bruges MLS Southampton would be today the Algerian centre mid yeah if you remember him not really and then MLS Pro League would actually be quite tricky to be fair oh there we go there's a really good one Christian Benteke MLS and Belgian Pro League to finish off the board another win to eat. going into the final round Tom let's see if you can uh, get yourself a consolation point final round Tom what would you like to start with let's go Manchester United Manchester United we will say Everton sure let's go Elsie you can't have two prem teams Tom why just said so I'll have uh, Juve Juventus I will say Atletico Madrid. I'll say uh, Barca. And I'll end off with a nation of... I'll say an Italian because I know it's easy for Juve, but the other two, a little bit more interesting. Okay, I'll take the middle square, Juve, Atletico, and I'll take Morata. Yep, that's a good one. Been everywhere, <laughs> but almost not been everywhere at the same time. Man United, Everton, we will say Phil Neville. I'll go Ali and Man United and go Makeda. Nice, back in the day. Everton, Barcelona, the best Spanish winger of all time, Gerard De La Feu. Okay, I'll go Juve, Everton, and I'll go Always Keen. Keen to get that one on? Yep. Oh, Italian at Juve, Tom, tricky. You want to hear. Let's just say a bit of Marchisio. I'll go Barca, Atleti, and I'll take Jao Felix. Yeah, current one. Yeah. Man United, Atletico Madrid. Bullet, bullet, bullet. Bullet. I've definitely got one, Tom. It's just if I can think of anything more interesting. No, I can't. Yeah, just... more interesting. No, just say the more interesting one that you're not sure on. <laughs> yeah, I'll go uh, Memphis Depay. The one I had before was Diego Forlad, so but either way. So... Doesn't matter, does it? I mean, you could have yeah. said David De Gea, I think, as well, couldn't you? Oh, yeah, that was a more obvious one. <laughs> and then <laughs> Italian at Barcelona, Tom, do you know one? I know Cadavaro played for Real Madrid, didn't he? That he played mm. for Barca as well. No. Don't know, mate. You got any? There's Thiago Motti, who's technically born Brazilian, but changed to Italian. Or there is Gianluca Zambrotta. Yeah. Like, Cool. Fair enough. I don't think it's too bad. I didn't get whitewashed, that's for sure. Which is always good. I guess. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's episode. Make sure you check out some. Drop them a sub and all that good stuff. Drop a like on the video. And we'll catch you all next time.